15th, Fairfield, California. Sounds like a cannon going off. These are 44 core, 400 compression balls. Adam Peterson from Mike and Sports flew in from Minnesota to make this video with us. And that's gone. Wow. <laughs> you hit one uh, before, right before we took the camera on in that tree in the middle of it, which I've played here 25 years. I've seen two or three hit there. Wow. That is jumping. We got a guy out behind there that's in the street, and he's catching those right at the street line, which is 400 feet. Just soon to be released, Mike and Ultra 2 senior softball bat two-piece. They've expanded the Ultra 2 line. We're bound to have one of those today. Wow. That sounds like bat meets ball and see you later. That cut through the center of that big tree out there at about 370. He pulls it down the line. 350, 360. Rob Taylor pitching cookies and Adam Peterson hitting bombs. <clears throat> that was just what he said, all his hands right there. He got jammed and he just threw his hands at it and hit a big bomb. Short pitch, gone. See ya. There's a lot of trees being hit here with this bat. It's his fifth video of the day. He's on his 300 plus swings. He's hit ASA bats, U-Triple-SA bats, and he's finishing the day with this Ultra 2 2 P Senior Bat. You can hear it. You can just hear the sound it makes. Yeah, that's that's an explosion. Can you imagine hitting that back at a pitcher? Sounds like this Mondo bat. Yeah. They're getting excited about it here, folks. There. Both batter, pitcher, and myself know this bat's something special right here. Got a two-piece technology, so you get more flex out of the handle. You just get more whip into it. Senior guys are gonna, oh yeah. But it hits it hard and far like an end-loaded bat. That's that's the thing, most balanced bats don't hit like that. That's that flex in the handle, I'm thinking. He's kissing that tree again. Yep, tree caught it. That was on its way to being a 400 footer. Another one, big bomb. We hit the first ever Ultra 2s here in 2002, the Gray Max loads. A lot of you guys remember that. We were the first ones in the nation to hit that bat. We hit it right here. And the balls we hit back then, 50, 47 core, 525 compression with that ultra back then. He's hitting the balls as far right now with 44 core 400 compression in this two-piece ultra. Two that we hit with Mike Romas and the boys Red back in 2002. Two. So, the balls have went backwards, the bats have come forwards. All right, here we go. This is uh, soon to be released, senior only. Mike and Ultra 2 two piece. Lowell Creek Park, October 16th, a real beautiful 85 degree day. Very little wind. They golf stat, and that's gone. Inside pitch, he bombs it straight up and out. 350, top of the hill. He's going long, folks. He just he just called for a 400 footer. We're gonna have to see. Uh oh. In the tree. Caught a tree. Close. I'm not gonna give him 400 yet. Uh oh. Hits the middle of the tree again. Consistent. 380 shots. Oh, that might do it. 
That's up and over everything. Yep. You in the street? That's all the green ones. Give me the 52. Yeah, he's in the street. We're going to hit the 52 course now. So you can see a lot of bats will go backwards on the 52, and it won't on the ultra two. Okay. Two feet. You got that right from Mike and Sports Representative Mouth. Uh, it's going to hit 52 core, 300 compression, and he bombed that. It sounds different, but it went 360. Uh, that's out of here, but it's foul a little bit. Just an inside pitch. Yeah, it's a different sound, but the, the ball carries well. That's the 52 300 core that a lot of senior players don't think that they'll play with, but if they ever go to it, keep in mind they're designing bats for that ball now that will work. And this is one. This will hit it well. Okay, that was a short pitch. He hit it with one foot in the air, 350 feet. That's crazy. Mike and Ultra 2, senior bat, two piece. Adam Peterson, Mike and Sports. Another short pitch. It's hard to believe it's balanced because it's hitting low pitches like an end loaded bat. That was 350 off the front foot again. Another short pitch. Man, it, it handles the short pitch incredibly well. Get something up uh, around the shoulders, Rob. Even further. Okay, that one was up right at the chest. And he hit the furthest tree out in left field. I'm gonna give you 399 on that. That's close, baby. That's close. He's Tommy Hawking him. So now you see, he hit the low pitch, he hit the high pitch. And if you put it in his chest, he's gonna mite it. Hit. He missed that. It went a measly 315 feet. This is probably the hottest bat. We've seen out her today. We fit five bats, ASA, U triple SA. This by far is hitting the furthest ball. There's no doubt about it. In the tree, in the tree, in the farthest tree, in the street. Just makes it effortless. Big bombs. You can see it generate the speed, isn't it? This is something we've never had, really. And according to Adam, the durability is way up on this bat, so not going to be as fragile as your normal black and red ultras, but it's going to hit probably further than they do and last a lot better is the technology they're trying to work on here. 44 core 400 compression. No, these are the 52 3, 300 compression. My bad, wow, that went in the middle of that tree. That, that's a 400 foot shot with a 52 core, th I gave you one. All right, thanks. These are 52 core 300. If that tree didn't catch that ball, it was in the middle of the street and we got a guy out there. Wow. You can hear the difference. That's a 44 375 and that's a bomb. It hits all balls, but you senior players, you get in a tournament with the 52 300, don't be worried. This, get this bat. This bat will cover it. I'm not sure your regular ultras will, but this one will. A couple more here, guys. Last one. Last one he called. Of course, to us, that means a good one. Well, one more. Well, one more. I told you. We never end unless it's a big one. Boom! <laughs> Crushed! See ya. Adam, what do you got to say about that bat? Guys, the biggest thing that you want to notice on this bat is the durability. We've been hitting these balls the whole time out here. They've gotten a little wet. These balls are more waterlogged than what you're going to use in games. I'm 36 years old. I'm not, I'm not qualified to play 15 over, obviously. So this bat is still holding up to waterlogged balls uh, with the upper level player hitting it. The durability, much better. You're gonna, this is the ultra two answer that you guys have been asking for. It's got a flex handle. There's more of you guys out there that have wanted something like this and we got it. And it hit all balls. All balls, everything. Good job, he killed it.